okay, now I'm here. It's time. I just said E for no reason. Why? Just saying. Just gonna find the pilot, whoever that was. Let's see who they were. Because I think it's this way. Because all the cuts leave. I think so. Because why are these right here? I think I hit a sea monkey. I'm sad now. I hit a sea monkey. Saddest thing. Top 10 saddest anime deaths be like. Hit, hits a sea monkey with the sea truck. I just hit that by accident. Oh, maybe I get achievement down here. I don't know. Did not tell you to <gasps> stay away from Ooh. what? I don't even know who you are. Marguerite made is the name. You're on my turf. Great. You're on my turf, like Can always. I come in and warm up? What part of go away do you not understand, Altera? <laughs> I'm not with Altera. Sam so just scanned some stuff. I did not mean to do that. Customize plan suit. Okay. Scan this. Oh, what that thing? That thing was scary. I told you to stay off. My grit. What's her name? You trained that thing? She's from the Next time I'll let other ship. From Altera. original Subnautica. I'm not with Altera. I'm Robin Ayu. I'm looking for information about my sister Sam. I think you might have crossed paths. Bull crap. I suggest you take the time you need to come to your senses and then get off my sea base. So like a... If you're not, Altera, you why don't you it? disable that damn tracking satellite tower instead of barging into my sea base? Maybe once Altera's off my back, I'll remember something about your sister. There's some junk on that table that might help. I couldn't get it to work. Oh, this is exciting. This is cool. Oh, glass dome. Hey, hey, yo, I love this thing. I like this place though. No, this is too late. I can't like, go over there. I want that skin. No, stop. I don't care. I'm getting over there, so. Do you have. How many eyes you have? <laughs> I sound like a little baby. Margaret Maida. That's. No, wait, is there any PDA over there? I swear there might be a PDA in there. Any PDAs? I knew there was a PDA, boy. Oh, I, no, wait, I have the first one of these then. So I remember getting them, not in the first episode, but while I wasn't f filming, I think I was live streaming. Oh, what this? Is this tablet? Oh, this is a tablet from the first game. Now I remember. I remember. Customer. No, wait, they, they haven't used this one for a while. I just realized it. Does this have like the original sea beast? Questions. Take one do. Uh, what do I need to find? I need it. Well, I also 
I don't need that stuff marked. I can do it later. Good at the plans. Where's the thing, Kababo? There it is. I I need one of those then. Okay, I have all of that stuff at the base. That mini base. Nothing else. There I was, 500 meters below sea level. Chunks of the sea base sank around me. One hand gripped the monster's scales. The other was clamped around the shard of metal I'd lodged into her eye socket. A reaper. Wounded, maybe, but still deadly. I'd already taken out one eye. I damn near carved out the other. We were headed for the void at the crater's edge. Blinded, she was spiraling deeper. I had a choice. Hold on, or let go. I clung for dear life as she took us deeper. I had one minute of air in the tank. Back then, I could go another three with what I had in my lungs. So I had four minutes to kill the Reaper, minus a few to get back to the surface. It ain't that I like killing folk. It's just sometimes what you need is on the inside of someone else's ribcage. I killed that beautiful, terrifying creature and I made for the surface. When I caught my breath, I realized we'd come further than I thought. I was surrounded by watery void, just me and ocean, nothing else. That far out to sea, swimming back for land wasn't an option. I'd die from exhaustion long before I made it to shore. All I could do was survive long enough to wash up somewhere. I felt a suction. And suddenly, there were vast jaws rising out of the water towards me. It had taken hours for the Reaper's corpse to float to the surface. Using the knife, I clambered up her flank and got a perch on top. I figured she'd float for a few days at least. Enough for me to catch my breath. But would she sink? before or after I died of thirst. I had a knife, a repair tool, and three liters of water. At least I wasn't gonna die of exhaustion. Now, those reapers, they're practically all muscle, but there's some fat in there. I was able to keep warm and drink the water. And I didn't have much, but I had that repair tool, so I had a spark. It took a week to light that first fire. And I know more about the burning properties of Reaper fat than I ever cared to. I had to ration fires, but as they burned, I could smoke meat that I carved out of the beast's ribcage. <laughs> 